C. Lindelof videos, AP calculus, increasing and decreasing absolute values of U. So here, we talked in the last video about differentiating absolute value X. Let me tell you that if, if I'm taking the, a multiple choice test, I'm not going to go through the differentiation of this crap. What I'm going to do is this. I'm just going to rearrange this and say, from algebra, I'm going to say that this is equal to the opposite of absolute value of X minus 5. And this here is a positive 5, so plus 5. This is called the vertex form, isn't it? It's the vertex form. We know that it's absolute value of x minus h plus k, and that the vertex is the point hk. Remember that this point h here satisfies the condition that this whole thing equals 0. So for what x value does x minus 5 equal 0? And it happens to be 5. So we have a vertex at 5, 5. So just as a picture, I'll take this. Say, okay, I have an absolute value function. <clears throat> I have an absolute value function, and this point 5, 5 is right here. Now I just need a little clue. And the clue is this. This opposite sign here, it works exactly like it does in a quadratic. That this negative sign right here tells us that what we have is a maximum value, right? Say negative, frowny face, it's kind of whatever, but it is true. So we know this. The only place that this function is going to change direction is here, at the, in this case, at this absolute value. So we can say this, that, that f of x is increasing for x is greater than is greater than negative infinity but less than 5 and f of x is decreasing for x is greater than 5 but less than infinity so that's how I would answer that, and I would leave that just the way it is if this was not a free response. If you want to know how I would answer this or chart this if it was a free response question, stay tuned for the next video. But if this was multiple choice, this is all I would show. What I'm going to do in the next video is show how I would find the derivative of this. So hopefully you'll stay with me. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe, especially Jeannie.